we're here at Internet of Things Philippines and today we're going to show you how to look for assets using RFID technology. So today we're going to help Angelica look for a USB desktop RFID device. So we're going to use this RFID handheld device which we'll use to look for the assets on our shelves. So let's go! Yep, found it. So this is the asset that we're trying to look for. This is a USB desktop device. So what we've used is we've used an on metal RFID tag. So this is metal. So what happens is we rely on the Geiger counter. So depending on the intensity of the counter, we can know how close or far are we from the asset that's being located. So as you can see right here, the Geiger counter increases as your distance between you and the asset gets closer and closer or farther and farther away. Okay, so depending on the asset that you're trying to look for or trying to tag for that matter, there's a lot of RFID tags that we can choose from. So depending on the asset, be it metal or non-metal, there's always the right tag for the right asset. So for more information regarding RFID or how RFID can help you, feel free to contact us here at Internet of Things Philippines. Again, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell below. See you to the next video.